I'm Nicholas Kristof. My career as a journalist has taken me all over the world, reporting stories of inequality, suffering, and humanitarian disaster. My wife, Cheryl, and I have worked together for decades, covering some of the greatest injustices of our time. Nicholas Kristof and Cheryl Wooden. Their coverage won them a Pulitzer Prize, which will be presented to them today. But we've become increasingly shocked by what's been taking place here in America. Life expectancy is dropping, drug addiction is rising, and more people are homeless than ever before. America is unique when it comes to inequality. We are the richest country on the planet with the worst poverty. That's who we are. The big question is whether or not there will continue to be opportunity for everyone, or even the ability to have the American dream. That's the question that we're facing right now as a nation. For me, the story of inequality in America has become increasingly personal. It really hit home when my high school buddy, Kevin Green, died, age 54. Kevin and I rode that number six school bus together. I wrote a column about him in the New York Times. Kevin's story seemed to touch a nerve, and I was struck by the lack of empathy in many of the comments. But what happened to Kevin wasn't just his own failure. It's part of a much bigger issue happening across America. 